hello guys welcome to how to fix tech in this video guys we are going to fix the issue or reboot and select proper boot device or insert boot media in selected boot device so how to troubleshoot this issue guys so first of all you need to have the bios knowledge of your laptop or the system what is the bios key so in the dell laptop the bios key will be f2 and in the hp laptop or the system it will be escape or the f10 key so you have to forcefully shut down your system guys press and hold the power key for almost 15 seconds so that your system gets shut down properly so once it is shut down properly you need to turn it on here and press the bootable key press the bios key now in here guys once you go to the bios in any device go to boot sequence and in the boot sequence you need to select the hard drive on the first priority as you can see here this is on the second priority so we need to up that now it is on the top so this will instantly fix your issue click on apply and once you click on apply you can see the boot order here Jabronex SSD is on the top and you need to select the same operating system I mean the hard drive on the top and it will instantly fix your issue after that click on exit you may go to the boot options in different different devices but you have to select the boot category and windows should boot now okay if window is not booting let's say if your issue is still not resolved guys you need to make sure that the hard drive is showing in the bios so again go to the and go to boot sequence okay and you can select also legacy option here you can switch from uefi to legacy and if legacy is selected you can select uefi okay select the legacy and then click on exit and it should fix your issue since we have changed the bios mode from legacy to uefi and uefi to legacy so this is the second option to fix this issue if the hard drive is not showing here guys it means that there is some issue with your hard drive so you have to replace your hard drive so how to check the hard drive is failed so the last option also you can try here load defaults okay this will load the default setting on your windows and it may fix the issue and in order to check the hard drive i need to press f12 key in the dell system now you can see hard drive is showing here in the uefi jabronex sd24 so this is my hard drive so you need to make sure that this is showing but you can run also diagnostic and click on enter and it will show you all the results if there is any issue with your hard drive since this is the hardware diagnostic test and this will confirm that there is some hardware issue in your hard drive and in this case guys you have to replace your hard drive you need to wait for almost two to three minutes here it's going to test all the components processor test in a progress now memory test in a progress now you should see testing is completed click on ok and in here guys you can see the right arrow key just click that option and here is the result all should be tick here like green tick all should be here especially the hard drive should be okay here you can see hard drive is showing here and hard drive is green make sure this is the exact result you are getting if hard drive is getting any kind of error you can rerun setup just click on the hard drive especially 
and the test is going now for the especially hard drive if your hard drive is ok and it is showing in the BIOS and it's still getting the same error guys you have to reinstall the fresh window make a bootable pen drive and then simply install a new window your issue will be fixed so you can also see the logs here guys as go to your result options and look for here hard drive DST short test and it is running and now it is passed so make sure it is passed here okay and after that you have make sure that it is passed and if your issue is still not resolved guys you can reattach the hardware once I mean the hard drive or you have to reinstall the fresh window if it is showing in the BIOS as well as the test is passed so this is how guys you can troubleshoot the issue hope your issue is fixed now if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech